This P0118 repairing video is dedicated to Ford's drivers. If your Ford is getting a P0118 error code, this video is going to show you two practical solutions to fix the error code at home. Use the Zeus app to scan your vehicle and see the error code P0118. It indicates the engine control module has seen the ECT sensor output go more than 4.91 volts or less than minus 40 degrees Fahrenheit. Here are two of the most practical solutions to fix Ford's P0118 error code. Method A, the ECT sensor. In most cars, the primary ECT sensor is installed near the thermostat in the cylinder head. Remove the ECT sensor from the engine. Use a multimeter to proceed with a test on the ECT sensor. At an ambient temperature of 68 degrees Fahrenheit, the sensor resistance is between 2000 ohms to 3000 ohms. If you do not get a reading, this indicates that the ECT sensor is faulty and needs to be replaced. However, if the ECT sensor has a correct reading, then we will proceed with method B. Method B, the thermostat. In most cars, the thermostat is placed near the water pump on the cylinder head. First, carefully remove the thermostat from the engine. The engine has to be cooled before attempting the process, and then install a new thermostat. To install it correctly, you need to make sure the short end goes toward the hose, and the deep end goes towards the engine. When you install it back to the engine, make sure the jiggle valve is pointed straight up to the top of the engine, so the air can get through the system. So here are two of the most practical solutions to fix Ford's P0118 error code. After the repair, you can now use the Zeus app to clear the error code. And tap the rescan button one more time to make sure everything is fine with your vehicle. To save more money on car expenses, claim a free engine code scanner at the description link below, or check out the video here for more info. You're also welcome to leave comments below, our mechanic professionals will answer them shortly. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks again for watching this video.